Hello, my dear friends on the internet. Welcome to another Cooking with Mindy on Get Fit with Mindy. Today, we are going to share a very delicious snack recipe, and it's also high protein jerky. It's actually, turkey jerky. And so, uh, when you go to the store and purchase jerky, either beef or turkey or pork, uh, if you look at the ingredient list, it's usually packed with a lot of chemicals, preservatives, and sugar, and it's also really expensive. It's actually much more cost-effective and healthier to make your own homemade jerky, either use a dehydrator and also an oven. And so if you don't have a dehydrator, this recipe is going to share how to make your own homemade jerky using just a conventional oven. So are you guys ready to get started? In a bowl, adding one tablespoon of light soy sauce, one tablespoon of red dry wine, stirring one spoonful of chili paste, garlic powder for extra spiciness, you can add in red paper flakes, stir well. Now we're going to add in our thinly sliced uh, turkey breast. Use a spoon to mix well, then cover with a plastic wrap. Store in the fridge for 6 to 12 hours. After 6 to 12 hours, uh, preheat the oven to 165 Fahrenheit. Then we're going to use a skewer to hand our turkey breast. Um, you can hand three or four, just make sure there's space in between each turkey breast. And then once you hand all the turkey breasts, make sure to line the bottom of the oven with aluminum foil to catch any grease or marinade. Now we're going to use the metal rack to uh, hand out a skewer. If you have a lot of them, make sure to leave a few inches in between. In this case, it's not a problem. After you hand all the turkey breast, cook in the oven for four hours or until dry. After four hours, you can eat this right away or you can store them for later. So hope you guys enjoy this uh, jerky recipe. You can also use beef, but just adjust the temperature to 142 Fahrenheit rather than 165 Fahrenheit. And so uh, this is really delicious and spicy, but you can also uh, play with your own spice profile. If you're not super into spicy jerky, you can take out the spice and you can also lower on the sodium level if you worry about sodium. So just add your own flair to this delicious jerky recipe. And so if you like recipes like this, we also have many other delicious recipes you can check out. And we also have fun workout videos every Tuesday if you don't know that already. And so hope you guys will have a fantastic weekend and make sure to click the like button and share, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already so you don't miss a single video. Have a great weekend, my dear friends. Bye. Portions. Now you're ready to put in the oven at 350 Fahrenheit for 30 minutes. Basically, just take the cracker out and let it just cool for about a few minutes. 